Denmark is often cited as one of the happiest and wealthiest countries in the world. With a high standard of living and a robust social welfare system, many envy the Danes' quality of life. However, what often goes unnoticed is the price they pay for it. Danish people are among the wealthiest people in the world, but they also pay some of the highest taxes. In fact, they can be taxed up to 56% of their income. In this video, we'll explore the reasons behind Denmark's high tax rates and how its citizens view the trade-off between wealth and taxes. Discover the secrets of the Danish tax collection. A peek inside. In 2023, the Danish taxation system will remain essentially the same as in previous years, with some updates to reflect the changing economic trends. The tax system in Denmark is progressive, meaning that those who earn more pay a higher percentage of taxes. The tax rates vary vary depending on income level, with the highest earners paying up to 56% of their income in taxes. The Danish government collects taxes through various channels, including income tax, value-added tax or VAT, and excise tax on certain goods and services. Income tax is the largest source of tax revenue, with employees deducting taxes from employees' paychecks and submitting them to the government on their behalf. Self-employed individuals must pay taxes directly to the government. The value-added tax or VAT is a tax on the value added to goods and services at each stage of production and distribution. The standard VAT rate in Denmark is 25%, with lower rates for essential goods like food and medicine. Excise tax are levied on goods and services like alcohol, tobacco, and gasoline. The Danish government uses tax revenue to fund a comprehensive social welfare system that provides citizens free healthcare, education, and social services like child and elderly care. The government also invests heavily in research and development, infrastructure, and environmental initiatives supporting economic growth and innovation. The Danish taxation system remains essential to the country's social welfare policies and economic growth strategy. While taxes may be high, the benefits to citizens are significant, ensuring everyone has access to essential services and resources regardless of their income level. How does the welfare system contribute to Denmark's economic growth? Denmark is known for its high taxes and generous welfare system, which may seem counterintuitive regarding the economic growth. However, these policies have contributed to making Denmark a wealthier nation. The Danish welfare system provides a safety net for citizens, ensuring everyone has access to healthcare, education, and other necessities. This allows people to pursue their goals and ambition without worrying about falling into poverty. In turn, this leads to a more productive workforce and higher levels of innovation. As people can take risks and pursue new ideas without the fear of failure. Additionally, the high taxes in Denmark fund a robust social welfare system that supports all citizens regardless of their income level. This includes free healthcare, education, and social services like child and elderly care. By redistributing wealth in this way, Denmark has reduced income inequality and ensured everyone has access to the resources they need to live a happy and healthy life. This has contributed to the country's strong sense of social cohesion, which also benefits economic growth, combining a strong welfare system system and high taxes has helped Denmark become a more affluent and prosperous nation with a high standard of living and a highly educated workforce. While this approach may not work for every country, it has undoubtedly been successful in Denmark and serves as an example of how social welfare policies can be used to promote economic growth and prosperity. How is Denmark GDP per capita so exemplary? Denmark's high tax rates have been a topic of discussion for many, many years, with some questioning how such high taxes can lead to economic prosperity. However, the reality is that Denmark's tax system has been one of the driving factors behind its increasing GDP and economic prosperity. The country's tax system is designed to fund social welfare programs, leading to a highly skilled and educated workforce. This has helped Denmark become one of the world's most innovative and productive countries. The High tax rates in Denmark allow the government to invest heavily in the education system, which is free for all citizens. This has led to a highly educated workforce that can take on highly skilled jobs, leading to a stronger economy. Additionally, the government invests in research and development, which has led to many successful companies and startups in Denmark. Moreover, the high tax rate in Denmark also fund the country's social welfare programs, which provide citizens with free healthcare, child and elderly care, and other essential 
essential services. This safety net allows citizens to focus on their careers and education, knowing they will always have access to the necessary resources to live fulfilling lives. It also reduces the income inequality gap, ensuring everyone has equal access to opportunities. While the high tax rate in Denmark may seem daunting, they have played a significant role in the country's economic growth and prosperity. By investing heavily in education and social welfare programs, Denmark has created a highly skilled and productive workforce, leading to a thriving economy. The government's transparency and accountability with how the tax money is used have also strengthened public trust and confidence in the system. All in all, the high tax rates in Denmark have been a fair trade-off for citizens' benefits, leading to a better quality of life for all. How Danish Taxes Are Spent Denmark's government truly cares about the well-being of its people investing in their quality of life and ensuring that tax money is put towards valuable resources. As a result, residents see their payments as an investment in society, knowing they benefit from the country's extensive welfare system and all its benefits. Denmark boasts an admirable education system with free tuition, including at the university level. This means that individuals can pursue their preferred career paths and interests without worrying about accumulating a large amount of debt. The country benefits from a well-educated society where residents feel appreciated and fulfilled. Having been able to choose their paths, the best part is that education is free and the state gives each university student a generous monthly allowance of around $900. This helps cover all the expenses related to student life such as accommodation, food, and other bills. Denmark's parental leave policy is a model for countries around the world. The state reinforces the value of family life by providing new parents up to 52 weeks of paid leave. This policy allows mothers and fathers to bond with their newborns and create memories that will last a lifetime. It's time for other countries to follow Denmark's lead and prioritize families' well-being by providing ample time to be together. Denmark's health law is founded on the principle that every citizen deserves equal and unrestricted access to healthcare. The country's healthcare system is designed to provide free medical care to all its residents, with most of the cost being funded through taxes. Danish citizens can rest assured that they will not be burdened with an overwhelming healthcare bill after receiving treatment. The healthcare system in Denmark is a source of pride for its citizens, as it provides them with a sense of security and comfort, knowing they can receive the best possible medical care without any financial constraints. We inform you with awe that in Denmark, parents only have to pay around 30% of nursery fees for their children. That's because the state covers the remainder, allowing parents to return to work as soon as they wish after having a baby without worrying about paying for childcare. This low cost of childcare is a huge relief for parents, especially compared to other countries where childcare costs can cause considerable stress and financial burden. With the Danish model, parents can focus on their careers and financial stability without sacrificing the well-being of their children. Have you ever wondered how the welfare state in Denmark takes care of its citizens when they reach retirement age? Well, let me tell you, it's pretty amazing. Once you turn 65, you can receive a generous monthly pension of around 8,000 kroner or $783 before tax. And that's not all. If you don't have any additional pension or income, you'll also receive additional benefits such as lower medicine prices and tax rates. But wait, there's more. If you've been widowed or you're over 65, you'll be regularly assessed to see if you require extra help. And if you're over 80, you're entitled to home visits. Can you imagine how reassuring it is to know that such support is available after retirement? It's no wonder that Danes are not afflicted with stress and worry as they get older. The welfare state has got its back. One of the critical reasons Denmark is one of the happiest countries in the world is because of how their taxes are utilized to fund state welfare programs. These programs provide essential services to its citizens such as healthcare, education, and social security. The Danes are proud of their welfare state and believe it to be a fundamental aspect of their society. Even the wealthiest Danes pay a significant tax towards these programs programs, but they are content knowing that their taxes are being used for the greater good. By investing in state welfare programs, Denmark has created an equitable society where everyone can access necessities and opportunities. This has helped boost the country's economy and made it a model for other nations to emulate.